My name is Iwani. This video is for J Frontier One. I want to add on to your answer. Um, first of all, let me let me say I see most of your videos and I like them a lot. This is some things that's okay. Um, you would ask a question about your loved ones. Would you deny Christ for the sake of your loved ones? You said yes. Uh, you would ask, will you go to heaven if you deny Christ? You said yes. I don't think it's a Bible-based answer. I think it's your own self-opinion. It's your own feelings. And if it is, you have a point. But Bible clearly shows in Luke chapter 14, uh, verse 25 to 33, that you have to hate your family you, for the sake of Christ and for the sake of being a disciple. also says that you got to count the cost. Salvation is free, but the cost of following Christ is expensive. It's, your, it's everything. It's, it's your whole life. Everything. Your love, your job, your, 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 your everything. So, the Bible says, pick up your cross and follow me. So, whatever is everything to you, that's what it costs. And, um, in, in Matthew chapter 10, verse 33, the Bible says this, Jesus speaking, Anyone that denies me before man, I will deny him before my Father which is in heaven. A genuine believer, a genuine Christian, a, a genuine born again, blood bought, Holy Spirit filled Christian will not deny Christ no matter what the, what the cost. I don't know what you think it means. Um, deny me and I'll deny you. I don't know what other Christian means, deny me or, and I'll deny you. But for me, it says, if I deny Christ, I can lose my place in heaven because he can deny me. The fact of the matter is, if you deny Christ, maybe you're not really a Christian. Maybe you're not a genuine Christian because according to this, you can lose your place in heaven. Alright? Um, God bless, man.